involved in broadband in our community, being you know part of the Sherburne mm -hmm. County government. Um, we had reports from local government and citizens of the low quality and expensive broadband in our region. And um, as Bill Coleman and others have talked about, you know, broadband really is an important aspect of our community that's just as important as the roads, the water, and the electricity that we run. Um, hearing from our community, we've worked and we've researched throughout the county um, and uh, worked with Deed and came to the, the numbers that we have on the, the graph here. Um, Sherburne County is kind of in the middle. They're in red. About 33% of our community is served um, at, at numbers that are, are adequate. And as you can see, the, the regions around us really do circle us with higher performance and, and better, more robust, more affordable uh, connectivity in our region. And so we decided to um, take more of a depth look at this, reached out with a survey through the Chambers of Commerce in our area. Um, and found out that the businesses really are underserved in our in our community. Um, based on those concerns, we applied and became a Blandon broadband community. Um, utilizing funds from Blandon, we worked on forming the Sherban Group. So Sherban is set out to help improve the connectivity within our county, and it is you know multifaceted. It's not just government. It's just not just business, but it is. You know, citizens overall, no matter what aspect of life they bring to our community. Um, we've continued to strive to work that, to improve that. We have Palmer Wireless bringing um, fiber into the city of Becker to help their businesses park out. Um, in the Zimmerman area, the city of Elk River and Sherburne County and the school district and the city of Zimmerman have partnered together to facilitate all of our forms of government by sharing different fiber segments within our community. Um, we're working to bring fiber to the History Center in Becker, um, and that will serve as a community meeting room and, and area in a region so people can come there and, um, and hold meetings and get the connectivity and the service that they, they're lacking. Um, so we continue to work and, and improve those services in the area. In 2015, we're seeing Palmer Wireless and CenturyLink applying for the border-to-border -border funding um, run through um, Dana McKenzie and the, the Dean Department um, to help Princeton and Clear Lake and Haven. So it's just kind of our goal in Sherburne County to strive and bring Sherban to the forefront, let the citizens hear about it, and have you join us bringing better service overall in our region.